Greetings Highlander fans, Alyssa Apisichea here at UC Riverside Soccer Stadium. Your women's team is now 3-1 and one and currently ranked first in the Big West Conference. They picked up a big victory tonight against Cal State Fullerton, winning 1-0. The win improved the Highlanders' record to 3-1 and one in conference, which ties them with UC Irvine and Cal Poly for the best record in the Big West. It didn't take long for UC Riverside to take the lead as Kelly Velasquez found goalkeeper turn forward Jessica Olofsson in the Titans box for the first goal of her career with just three minutes and 51 seconds gone in the first. Jessica, great win tonight. Now you scored your first goal of the season. What was going through your head when you scored? Um, honestly, you just kind of get to the goal for Kelly to cross it. I mean, I knew she would get through the defenders. She's really good at that. So I just kind of like get to the goal and get a touch and it happened to go in. So. Cal State Fullerton pushed for the equalizer the rest of the match, unleashing 10 shots, including seven on goal. But Highlanders keeper Elizabeth Silas kept the UC Riverside net clean for her third shutout of the season. The last 15 minutes of the game, they put a lot of pressure on you in that goal. Tell me, what was going through your head? We gotta stick with it, we have 15 minutes left. We worked so hard. Like we finished, what was it? It's about, what, 60 minutes of hard work? You can't let down the last 15. You gotta stick with it. And just thinking about how bad we wanted this and deserved it. Coach, you're now three and one in the Big West Conference. Can you tell me how you thought tonight's game went? Um, really well. I mean, our, our, uh, our ability to bounce back this year has been awesome. Um, we've had some losses on Fridays and come back on, on Sundays and very similar this weekend. Um, the girls were, were awesome. We, we fortunately this year went 2-0 and, and and just the program where it's at, they just have never been in that spot before and so I think Thursday's game um, kind of showed that and I think uh, we, we had a long talk about owning what we're doing and um, they owned it tonight and they, they expected to win, they expected to play hard and the results are, they are what they are but um, we played hard, we did everything right um, and I was just really proud of them for, for bouncing back. The Highlanders are on the road this weekend as they visit Cal Poly in UC Santa Barbara. As always, you can follow all the action at GoHighlanders.com.